All right, Paula, so, you know, I'm working, I'm getting my kids back to school, I'm packing lunches, I'm just like slouched over all the time and now everything hurts, oh my, <laughs> what do I do? Okay, well, a lot of times what people like to do is they like to use massage balls, um, either smooth or spiky, and those work really well, but a lot of times people don't have these handy or available. One. If you're at home, you can use a small pillow. And so pretty much what you're gonna, <laughs> What you're gonna do is you're pretty, just gonna lay back on the pillow in your mid back. Okay. So we'll just have one. Alrighty. Have it help. scoot up a little bit where your head's gonna come off the pillow a little bit. Alrighty. Like that. And relax. Mm -hmm. I think anybody knows how to relax, <laughs> or they try to relax. And so pretty much laying like this is going to slowly undo that curvature that we have, that bending forward that we have. So if you can do this about five, 10 minutes a day, it's gonna really help with loosening up that back, which translates up to headaches. Now Paula, what do I do if I have a headache back here and I do that, you know, like when kids interrupt you and things, <laughs> and I have like pain here, should I move that up? Should I put like, pretend these are tennis balls? What do you think? Back here. Yeah, that would also be very helpful. So Paula, I can see how laying there will help break this area, mm -hmm. but what happens when up through here is hurting? What should I do? And side note, if you are pregnant, consult your doctor first, because there are contraindicated points for pregnancy and, and acupressure or massage in this area. You can also take some massage balls. These are a little bit more intense than the pillow, so you want to find a spot that's on your back that's sore and roll it up and down. So whether you're doing this up against a wall, laying on the floor, or on the bed, even having a pillow to give it a little bit more cushion, it's going to really work out those knots. Now, Paul, if I don't have your fancy massage ball, could you use a tennis ball or you a golf ball? You can use a tennis ball, ball a golf ball. Golf balls are kind of hard, so I would prefer a tennis ball over a golf ball. And can you show me that motion one more time? So, and you're pretty much going to find a spot. Yep, that's it. And roll it up and down. Okay, so let me try this. Yeah, I feel like I'm trying to do it, but I'm tightening myself, so if I were to lay down, where okay. would I do that? So you're going to go ahead and lay down. And add here, raise up a little bit. And you're going to put it right in your oh yep that's mid spot upper back. you're going to find a spot for sure and you will know the spot when you find the spot and now do i roll it in do you i can do? lay there if you need something a little bit more intense you can move around to, to the spot that it feels good move around in there okay, i can see that really Down. dig that out okay and do that as long as it's comfortable you don't want to do it and then i would just switch yeah just switch sides ah. But this really is, you've got to find the spot. Oh, for sure. And you, right will, there. you will know when you found the spot. And we got it right there. So you can go ahead and do that. So like I said, oh, you can do that up against it. the wall, on the floor. Thanks, Paula. You're magical.